Thank you so much, everyone. Thanks so much for staying with us. Let's get back to our panel in our Buja studio. Chief Chakwa Zokore is a national chairman of the UPP, and Senator Ayu Arishe, a former lawmaker and a chieftain of the APC. Quickly, uh, to you now, uh, Chief Okore, as it stands, you heard the argument. The, the Senate president asking that why is it that the executive waited all this long to submit a budget? But look, uh, Professor Isisage does not seem to believe, and he's saying, look, the day is if there is a further weight uh, and logging on this budget, there might be need to activ activate uh, the doctrine of necessity. Do you think it will get to that? Well, um, we are gradually getting to the point where the president may have to exercise his uh, right of. Uh, um, he has the president has a special dispensation he can exercise in a case of emergency. I may not call that uh, uh, doctrine of necessity, but let me point out here that I do not agree that the pre senior president has ceased to exist as senior president by the fact of his defection. They, they, they are divided, they are divergent views as to what ought to be his fate, but I agree with the suggestion that the Attorney General of the Federation can quickly go to the Supreme Court for interpretation. That is the only thing that can bring some bit of uh, sanity to the whole uh, quagmire we find ourselves in. But rather than allow a situation where a neck will not have the funds to prosecute this election, I will be of the opinion that the President will exercise his right of special dispensation as president of Nigeria to intervene and uh, provide the funds for the election to, to, to take place. What has happened in the National Assembly is unprecedented. Whatever the law says, there is a moral question. This, that is no, it is not anywhere in the history of this country that the uh, senior president, who was elected on the platform of his political party, defected to the, uh, to the other political party. Uh, this is this is always a sore point in our in our uh, the history of our democracy. But be that as it may, it will even be more chaotic if uh, the clerk of the National Assembly proceeds to go and reconvene the National Assembly under the circumstance. So why the president should be weighing the option of uh, intervening through his special dispensation, let the Attorney General proceed to the uh, Supreme Court immediately, and the uh, Supreme Court, I'm sure knowing that uh, there is an emergency situation facing Nigeria, will we'll, uh, uh, expedite action in that direction and give uh, uh, its own interpretation of what has happened so that we can continue. We still have a long way to, uh, to the end of this administration. Even after the election, this administration will still be there to, up to May, no matter who wins and no matter who uh, loses, up to May ne uh, next year. And so we cannot have an executive that uh, doesn't see eye to eye with the National Assembly up to May next year. That is too long a period to be in kind of quagmire. 